Hi friends, I'm Megan and this is Jessie. And this is Ruby. Hello Ruby. I'm glad you could join us for today's Bible story. I thought Ruby would enjoy hearing today's Bible story about Jonah getting swallowed up by one of her ancestors. <laughs> that is a great idea, Jessie, but did you know the story of Jonah is not mostly about Jonah getting swallowed by a big fish? It's not? But, but there is a picture of the big fish on the front of my Bible story book about Jonah. Are, are you sure, Megan? I'm sure, Jessie. The book of Jonah in the Bible is mostly about God showing mercy to people who do not deserve it. Let me tell you the story. Listen for who God showed mercy to. Jonah was a prophet. One day, God told Jonah, go to Nineveh. Tell the people there to stop doing wrong things. The people in Nineveh were very mean. So Jonah did not go to Nineveh like God told him to do. Instead, he got on a boat to go far away. God sent a storm. The sailors on the boat asked Jonah, who are you? Where did you come from? Jonah said, I worship the one true God who made everything. Jonah told the sailors to throw him into the sea. The sailors picked up Jonah and threw him into the sea and the storm stopped. From that moment on, the sailors worshiped the one true God. God sent a big fish to swallow Jonah. Jonah was in the fish's belly for three days and three nights. Jonah prayed and thanked God for sending the fish. Then the fish vomited Jonah onto dry land. God said, Jonah, go to Nineveh. Tell the people my message. This time, Jonah went to Nineveh. He walked into the city and shouted, in 40 days, God will destroy Nineveh. The people in Nineveh listened. They stopped doing wrong things and showed God that they were sorry. God decided not to destroy Nineveh. Jonah was so mad. I knew you would do this, Jonah said to God. You are gracious. You do not give people what they deserve. You are slow to get angry and you love people. Is it right for you to be mad? God asked Jonah. Jonah went outside the city to watch what God would do. Then God taught Jonah a lesson. First, God made a plant to shade Jonah from the sun. Then, God sent a worm. The worm ate the plant and the plant died. Then, God sent wind. Jonah was so hot, he almost fainted. He was not happy. God asked, are you mad that the plant died? Yes, said Jonah. God said, you cared about the plant, but you did not take care of it or make it grow. The city of Nineveh has many people. I made them and I care about them. There are many animals too. Aren't people and animals more important than a plant? God told Jonah to go to his enemies and tell them to stop sinning. Jonah did not want to go. Later, God sent his own son, Jesus, to go to his enemies and tell them to stop sinning. Unlike Jonah, Jesus wanted to obey God. He died on the cross to save us from sin.